Oh, it's almost like it's 4:02 exactly. It's almost time. It's time. It's time. Official it's time. blast off. It's time. Official blast off. All right. All right. Good we'll, luck, guys. Good luck. We'll, we'll give him a head start. I'm giving him a head start. Whoa! Look at him go. He's he's, <laughs> he's actually cruising. But we're we're gonna get him. We'll give him a 30 second head start. I know this is a kind of a random start to a video, but uh, I promise in just a little, I'll explain what's going on. Jeez. So I can't explain it just yet, guys, but you'll see. We gotta do something right now. Gotta do something. <sighs> Have to weigh our best five today, and I'll explain why, I promise, shortly enough. We're waiting for a call, but we gotta weigh our best five today. One eight. One, eight. One pound, eight ounces. Okay. Let's put another one on real quick. Down there. Man, this is the first. Got a little pack of coyotes out here. Kind of cool. They're just like running up and down this bank. Four of them, it looks like. Man, I've seen it all out here now, I feel like. Just being in Northern California, what have we seen? We've seen rattlesnakes, bears, deer, of course, foxes, and now coyotes. I've heard them before, I've just never seen them. I don't know what they're doing. Oh God, <laughs> now I see what they're doing. So they haven't left, which they're just kind of looking at me. I think I spooked them a little bit. That one dude's just chilling there, he won't leave. <laughs> but I see why they're, they're here. I don't know exactly what that is. Maybe a small deer or something. They were munching on it though. Yeah, we'll leave them be. Let them have their breakfast. Get the spoon. You should hit that spoon. Dude, what the heck? They're not getting it. That one pulled the pantalones down. How are you not getting it, guys? He's a keeper. He's probably a keeper, but we're not going to weigh him. Yeah, feels good to get a jig bite once again, though. Got her. Man, that one 
didn't even, didn't even feel that one. Goodness gracious, that might be good. It's so hard to tell though. Come on, come on. Light line, small hook. More about the small hook, like I've said, than the light line. Just in case we got him skinned hook, we don't want to dog him too hard. I think he's good though. That's why I was fighting so hard. Because he was a, a mean mouth. Or is that a mean mouth or a small mouth? That's a mean mouth. Oh my gosh. How many times have we seen that guy fighting a fish and all of their friends follow? It just shows there's a million bass here. I think we can weigh that one. That one's gonna be number two for us. I zeroed. One six. Mm, number two. Super subtle bite. Didn't even feel that one. Definitely a little school of fish right here. Bunch, a bunch of his buddies are with him. Yeah. We ain't gonna make the team. We could make the team, but we're not even gonna weigh you. Eh, I don't know. Should we weigh him just in case? You never know, I guess. Yeah, can't weigh the pounders. That's just uh, embarrassing. Oh my god! No! No! Oh my god! Oh my god! No! No! Oh my god! Dude! We just had a bite! Oh no! I know what you guys are going to say right there. I need to add that stinger <sighs> with that harness. I mean, I'm not that fancy yet with swim baiting, but I would have paid some money to have had that stinger harness apparatus on the HUD right there for sure. I, I, we were hooked up for a second. That was a bite. That was no doubt. That was a fish. I can't believe we just got bit on it. We are on the hunt for a kayak. I think I see a kayak. Dun, 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 dun. We're hunting kayaks. There he is. Man, you got a lot of catching up to do. How many fish do you got? 30, 30 pounds. Ooh. No, I'm just joking. I got two fish for three pounds. That's it? Dude, it's tough. Roll it. Sorry to record. Yep. All right, folks. Welcome. We already started the video, but uh, we uh, we knew that uh, we would be doing a little something different today. It's one o'clock and we're joined by this guy right here, Rob Metsura. If you guys watch fishing videos on YouTube, I guarantee you've seen him at some point. You may not remember where, but... Uh, I'm usually behind the camera, though. You've made some cameos. Some cameos. But if you guys know where he's from, comment below. Last time I was out, it was on my private pond. Yes, he's been on the, he's been on my channel before. We've upgraded. Yeah, yeah. Last time we were out, we were on a, uh, a little little guy. It was a tournament, and now we're doing another tournament. One v one kayak versus bass boat. I guess the big question is, we I've started. I've had a tremendously terrible day so far. I've got two fish for about three pounds. Does that count? Does that count? Handicap, kayak, I mean, you got a little bit of an advantage, I would say. No, I heard you You do pretty well in this kayak. <sighs> we'll give it to you. Okay, okay, we'll so we're good. Five fish limit, heaviest five. What does the winner get? I kind of, I want that Huddleston from that last video. That so, one looks pretty sweet. And so, I heard it got bit, so. HUD for HUD. I have a HUD on my rod, you have a HUD on your rod. So the winner gets the other's Huddleston. It's gonna take, I mean, I got three pounds already. I'm hoping for 14 pounds. 14? Oh God. It's about one o'clock, we're gonna go till 4.30, meet up. Let's do it guys, we'll see what happens.
All right, it's 2.13, it's been like 40 minutes. We stomped on three spots real quick. Only got three rods out. Haven't found any bait yet, but that's all we're looking for is some bait. I've been scanning around. Hopefully we'll see some here. There was some here a couple weeks ago, so. If you don't see anything, just keep moving. But once we find them, it's gonna be game on. I think I'm gonna text Greg and text him my picture. I found one school of crappie, but he won't know the difference. Gotta get it in his head, so we're gonna text him that right now. Got a text from Rob right here. That's his text to us, eh? Got her. Oh, it's a piggin. That's a net worthy fish right there. Oh my god. Oh, Robbie. <laughs> Leave it to me to catch a big fish for once. Choke the jig. Well, that's going to help our cause for my kayakers out there. It's a better kayak bass in a tournament than it would be for a boat tournament. It's kind of skinny. Two eight, man, that's a, that's a long two eight. Two eight, okay. I think we gotta keep rolling with the jig. There we go. The jig is the only thing that really will get bit. Not a, not a bad one. Number four. I think the jig is the way to go, folks. One pound, three ounces. Thank you, sir. It is interesting though, to, like that bite again, did not feel that bite. Usually you can feel those jig bites. That fish just picked up the jig, swam off, just like the other ones. It's a really weird bite. It's weird they're not biting the worms though, the drop shots. It seems like the jig is definitely outperforming the, the worms. There's like five fish up here. Hopefully I can get one to bite. Is it a bass? Yeah. No way. Shut up. I swear. Oh, I need that. Probably. All right. If I don't catch one here, something wrong. I was gonna say, Jeez. it's loaded. Look at <laughs> right there. We're on the board. Those it's loaded. Oh gosh. Smally. We found him. Come on. Man, now I gotta weigh it. I'm sticking it in the back. Catch a bunch real quick. Oh gosh, gotta hurry. You're like all up in there. Look at that. Oh, oh, oh. oh god, here they come, here they come. Oh, you just missed it. Going right through and one came up for it. Alright, here's my bait going down. I'm almost to them. They're right there. Oh, there's one going to it. Come on. Oh. Now am I not getting bit in that? Oh. 
You're not getting bit, right? Look at it. Look at, my, look at the screen. They're going through the bait, like chomping. You could see them sometimes. They're going after mine when I get bit. I got bit like twice after that last fish. I don't know what just happened. <laughs> he choked him. Oh, God. Oh, God. I wasn't like holding my rod. Oh, gosh, they're under us. Look at the birds are starting to fly. Oh gosh, it's about to happen. I'm wait for this fish just to get on the board. We want to know. Right. First one's a largemouth. 180. All right. 230. 231. 231. Small mouth, nice one. We need to catch two more fish real quick. Can this work one time? Just one time, I just want to be able to drop down and catch one. I've done this so many times today. I've seen them on the graph, just drop down, but no takers. Something hit it. How lucky was that? That's a big one too. Oh god. What the heck? Oh god. Premature net job. We gotta lock this jig in our hand the rest of the day. Number five. Thank you. 112. Yeah. 112. Number five. Dude, I did not feel that at all. I got something on there. It's stuck in something. It's stuck in the brush. Oh, wow. I got line. <laughs> Dang, that felt like a fish. <sighs> I didn't know line fought. There's a fish. That's not line. That's a big spot. That jig is seriously doing work. It's a good one. Whoa. Look what's down his throat. Ew. Man, this guy really likes fake crawfish. I know, sorry. I wasn't thinking. Don't pollute the lake. But geez, I really don't want to keep that in my boat. I guess I will for now. Most definitely a call. 110. Thank you, sir. So big. Jeez. Don't come off. Oh, there's a bunch under me. Right, cast right here. Spot me sick. Big old spot. All right, here's number three. Can't believe how tough this is. Two, eight, 
288. Man, the last fish I had for that was 557. <laughs> understand how I'm not like just catching on these every single rock. Alright. One oh gosh, they're under us right now. gonna call I think Dude, we got the mega slam today guys got the large mouth the spot the mean mouth and the small mouth now it's the mega slam mm, I don't think he's gonna call nah, he's not gonna call I think we got to get it rid of a 1-6 no Yeah. Oh, man. <laughs> yeah. I know, I know. Are you ready? If you didn't have your handicap? Um, I don't know actually. Oh man, we'll probably be close then. I Go know. ahead. Okay folks, we're we're here, it's dark, we're back. Tough day on the water for sure. Best five. I'll go first. Uh eight twelve. I finish with eight twelve. Eight twelve? For best five. Oh man. Uh-oh. Let's see. Wait, well I gotta add mine up. Oh god. Oh so close. How many did you get? Did you get a limit? 8.75, what'd you have? 8.12. I beat you. <laughs> Wait, is that? I beat you, it was four. Are we tied? Is 8.75. 8 is 8.75 equal I had to 8? I think 8.12 was 8.75. Really? What was your big fish? A 2.88. You had a 2.88? Yeah. Damn it, Rob. Did I get you? I had a 2.8 for my big fish. Oh, that's a tiebreaker. Tiebreaker should be big fish. It is, it is. You got, you got me. <laughs> <laughs> I know. I literally, if you go through, like it was a. I don't know if you'll have a video because it was it was tough. Like it was miserable. Oh, we'll make a video. I just put it, a 16 minute video out of me not catching a fish all day. <laughs> it was really tough. They were schooling on the graph, and a couple of times yeah. I got them on the drop. So, well, congrats, Rob. Rob beat me. It was a tough day. A solid. <laughs> we caught fish at least. We caught fish. I think I had a Huddleston bite too. I'm like 99.99 percent sure it was Huddleston. Bite. Nice. What do you think, Rob? I don't know, I think the challenge in Barry S is tough. We gotta do a rematch. We gotta do a rematch? Yeah, and I gotta get out here early. All right, guys. As always, thank you guys for coming along. Thank you to this guy for the little challenge. See ya.